Vladimir Putin plans to step down next year amid health concerns, report claims. Here's a summary of the article. Vladimir Putin is planning to step down next year as speculation swirls in Russia that the longtime president may have Parkinson's disease, a report said Thursday. Moscow political scientist Valery Solovey told The Sun that the Russian strongman's 37-year-old girlfriend, Alina Kabareva, and his two daughters are pushing him to leave office. There is a family, it has a great influence on him. He intends to make public his handover plans in January, Solovey told the news outlet. Solovey also suggested Putin may be suffering from Parkinson's as the president has been seen recently exhibiting symptoms of the disease. Putin recently appeared to be in agony while appearing to constantly shift his legs, according to footage reviewed by an observer, The Sun reported. Reviewed footage also appeared to show his fingers twitching as he held a cup that possibly contained medicine, the report said. Speculation of Putin's possible departure comes as Russian lawmakers are considering legislation proposed by the president that would grant ex-presidents lifetime immunity from criminal prosecution. This post received a score of 43,000, with an upvote ratio of 62%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. This is the same paper that keeps saying Kim Jong-un is dead. Yes, but somehow the guy keeps on coming back from the dead. Juche Necromancy. LMAO there's only so many places online that make this joke. Who is the owner of this scurrilous newspaper involved in necromancy? My god, it's Kim himself, from the top rope. With a steel chair. No wonder why they're trying to make ex-presidents immune from prosecution. It's the New York Post reporting on the sun. Both are famous tabloids. Hold your horses until an actual news source reports on this. It's the New York Post reporting on the sun's interview with some guy who says he thinks Putin's girlfriend, who he's probably never met, will tell him to step down and he'll listen. Yeah, I'm a hold my breath on Putin stepping down. He's only 68 too. Makes sense then, he is holding for 69. Horaso, is that UWU in Russian looks like UWU in Russian? I'm going to wait until I see this posted from a more credible source, or more accreditation from other more mainstream sources, because Putin wouldn't have worked so hard to consolidate power in Russia if he intended to step down. This Parkinson's rumor was running around in 2015 as well. So let's wait for Reuters or App. We'll see how it shakes out. Sorry. I didn't want to laugh at that. It just happened so naturally. This announced literally hours after Russia declared that presidents have immunity from prosecution for life. Hum. They don't have it. Yet. Netanyahu. Netanyahu serious. I love you. Ah shucks. I love you too. Now kith. Kith and kin. Russia. All past presidents have immunity from all crimes Putin. Right, I'm a head out now. Mission accomplished. Plus he apparently has like 200 billion cash stored away overseas. I don't think that's a realistic amount for any world leader to have in cash. House of Saad enters the chat. For real. They're probably over a trillion in assets. And his brother Vladimir Putin will take power. Why does his brother have a different last name? Irrelevant. This being the NY Post I'll believe it when almost anyone else reports it. This kind of stuff makes the rounds every once in a while, Reddit jumps on things way too fast sometimes. I still haven't forgotten a post a couple months back that claimed Kim Jong-un was basically brain dead. The title should include that it's heavily suspected he has Parkinson's. Oh my god is that our November surprise. When Putin dies Trump will be lifted from his curse like the king of Rohan. Parkinson's disease won't just kill him off like that. My grandmother had Parkinson's for like 30 years before passing away. He's probably considering stepping down if this is true because traveling so much is getting harder for him now. Edit. Traveling is probably getting harder for him now if it's true I mean. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.